Plastic injection molding is one of the three main processes available to make parts. The other two are machining and 3D printing, also known as additive manufacturing. Injection molding produces thousands to hundreds of thousands of the same part fairly economically, as the main cost is the development of the mold and the material used for the parts. For plastic injection molding, the materials include elastomers, thermoplastic, and thermoset polymers. Benefits of this process include excellent repeatability, as every part produced has the same dimensions and quality, low cost due to high volume, and fast production time. Plastic injection molding equipment typically operates this way. Material feeds into a heated barrel and is then pushed with some type of plunger into a mold. The material cools in place. Once cooled, the mold halves are open and the cooled part is ejected. Molds are custom made, usually of a metal that can handle the injection pressure and the heat of the desired material. Thus, tool steel is the usual material used to create a mold, as this material can handle these conditions for millions of times of use. To save money, sometimes aluminum is used for the mold, but there are limitations in types of materials that can be injected and in the number of times this mold can be used. Injection molding is used for a range of parts, medical components, car body panels, bottle caps, product packaging, toys, small furniture, storage containers, some plastic gears, and many more. For more videos like these, go to designworldonline.com.